Hey babes, yes, we are back for one more video with the same makeup look and the same shirt. So I am filming three videos tonight, so if you see me wearing the same look and the same shirt, that is why. Hi, hello, if you don't know, my name is Jeannie and this is Sips, Lips, and Makeup Tricks where we do all things beauty, specifically BoxyCharm and Ipsy, makeup hauls, makeup and skincare reviews, get ready with me's, and all kinds of things beauty. I also do monthly giveaways and milestone giveaways giveaways. So right now I have a 500 subscriber giveaway open that is worth well over a thousand dollars retail value. All you have to do for your entry is smash that subscribe button. Be a subscriber here on the channel and we have a lot of fun here. We are really like a family here. So I would love to have you and then leave me a comment on that giveaway video. I will link it in the description box below. So if you're new, you can easily find it and get your entry. You won't want to miss out on that. And then keep in mind, I do do giveaways like that here all the time. So for today's video, you guys, I am so excited. I ordered one of those Ipsy mystery bags. This one was the Glamiversary bag. It is supposed to be full five full size products and you do get the bag with it. Um, I, when I, now I love glitter stuff, but I just gotta say when I see this, it makes me think of Cece from Cece's Trial Size Life. She does not like glitter or at least glitter that she has to touch. And I don't know why this just, I could just imagine her getting this and opening it and being like, oh my God, oh my God. So I actually love it though. I think it's gorgeous. Anyhow, so this did cost me $30, I think. And it's five full-size products. So let's just go ahead and jump on into the goodies and see what they sent me because I'm so excited. Okay, so first, it looks like I've got a product from Murad, which is a very well-known skincare brand. I have multiple things from the line and I absolutely love each one that I've tried. This does not look like something that I have in my collection or something that I have tried, so I'm excited for it. It is the Hydration Sensitive Skin Soothing Serum. Okay, so definitely something that I will try. I know my husband is a ginger that has very sensitive skin. Um, and so are my two youngest children that, um, are from, you know, that, that is their dad. They definitely take after him with the red sensitive skin. So I don't think I'll be putting this on my one and my two year old, but maybe my husband will want to try it out on one of those nights where he's kind of like having like a flare up or whatever happens with his skin. I don't have sensitive skin, but I am a skincare junkie and I love this line. So definitely excited to have it, whether I'm going to use it myself or let my husband try and use it if he will. Sometimes he does. Sometimes he'll be like, okay, what do you got for me? <laughs> But let's just go ahead and move along. So next from Pacifica Beauty, we have the Cheeky Cherry Cheek Stain. And this is in the shade Cherry Baby. So it looks like it's like a liquid blush. Let's go ahead and see what she looks like. Now I know sometimes these products... Yep, it smells like cherry. That smells really, really good, actually. So let's see how it blends out. Ooh, that's a really pretty color for the fall. Now, you saw what a little amount I put on there. So I'm going to tell you a little goes a long way with this. You do not need a ton of this at all. Literally, I put like a drop. Let's try this again. So like we'll pretend like we're trying to do our makeup with it. Literally. That is going to be all you're going to need, like even if that, and just kind of, so what I would do is if I was doing my makeup, I would take my little brush blush and kind of stipple that in to the skin until it was blended in nicely. This is a really nice brush, by the way, from BH Cosmetics. I love this brush, but that is pretty. Let's blend this side in just for fun. Just kind of stipple it in. Like if I was doing it on my cheeks, I would be using my brush and just stippling that into the skin, into the area that I wanted to blend it out in. So just a really, really pretty color for fall. And it smells so good. I really like that. That is cool. Okay. 
I have a ton of liquid blushes. I have been so into the cream products lately. Um, just as of recently, within like the last few months, I have been really getting into the cream products. I feel like they just have such a nice finish on my starting to age skin, if that makes sense. Okay, so next from Ella Massaqua, we do have the Beyond Liquid Highlight. Ooh, some more liquidy cream products. Okay, so this is a highlight. This is what the packaging looks like, kind of basic, but let's check out the products. So it does come with like a little squeezy top there, and I'm sure you probably won't need much of this either. Ooh, that is pretty. Now, I love my highlight, so I will definitely be using this in an upcoming look. Look at the glow on that. Ooh, that is really, really pretty. Okay, cool. I'm excited for this. I actually have a few from Anastasia Beverly Hills that I thought I would love, and they just kind of like over texturize. Now, any highlight is going to texturize. It Highlights texturize your skin. They just do. But some are way worse than others. And the ones that I have from Anastasia Beverly Hills, I was kind of disappointed in, actually. I thought they were going to be so stunning, and they are. The coloring in them is gorgeous. But the way that they, maybe it's just me and my skin type. They just over texturize just a little more than what I would like. <laughs> so anyhow, moving right along, we do have two products left. So one is from Artist Contour and this is the Silky Lip Oil. I love my lip oils. In fact, right now I have on my... Buxom Plump Line Liner. So this comes with a liner on one side, a plumping liner, mind you. Now, I don't know how that happens, but apparently it does. And then it's got a little brush on the other side. I love this component. I love this product. And then on top of this, I have my NARS Lip Oil on. And that is literally all I have on my lips right now. So I love me some good oils. Let's check out this one. Ooh, it's a really pretty kind of bubblegum pink. I'm sure that it goes on quite sheer. Mm, it's got a light fruity scent, nothing overpowering or anything like that. Just a light fruity scent. So that is cool. And then last but not least from Tarte. Ooh, we've got the Lights Camera Lashes Mascara full size. You guys, I actually have this literally right here in my drawer. So this is what the packaging looks like on that. That is super, super cute. And I'll show you what the wand looks like. So it's one of these. And this is actually a really bomb ass mascara. It really, really is. So obviously I have one open. I'm not going to open this. I actually might go ahead and put this in a future giveaway because I have one right here, or I might save it for a backup. I don't know yet, but Either way, keep your eye open. This might be coming in a upcoming giveaway. And so for $30, I'm really, really happy with that. I think that's a good, uh, that's a good mix of stuff. So we've got one skincare. We've got one liquid blush. We've got one liquid highlight. We've got a lip oil and we've got a mascara. I think that is good. I love doing the little mystery bags. I had got some in the summer and I really, really enjoyed those as well. So yeah, I'm happy with that one. And that's going to be it for this video, guys. I am exhausted. I filmed three videos tonight and I need to get my butt upstairs to bed. So until next time, stay safe, stay beautiful, and I will see you soon in my next video. Bye.